Hi everyone, it's Trevor Lord from the Trevor Council and Associates, here live for DCA News. To, to start today's broadcast, um, the DCA will be meeting this week. Uh, the council members uh, will be meeting to discuss about the future for the TCA as the um, uh, the year progresses uh, through the year. Uh, they will decide what the future of the TCA headquarters is, uh, since funding may be limited in the upcoming days. So, um, we are going to be working on a lot of things, um, basically on gaining more members, gaining more support, and things like that, and hopefully we can work on that as we're going. But whatever happens, the TCA will still exist, and we are still going to be able to live on uh, as an organization, whether we are the council or not. Um, so we are working on a lot of more new things and a lot of cool things. So, uh, the other day the black team uh, worked on basically finding the history timeline for the TCA and we were able to post a lot of posts on fa our Facebook page and uh, basically of what uh, the history and things are back. The black team has also confirmed that they will be making a video montage of all the history of the TCA and things like that. Uh, the TCA has also recognized that March 26th is the official TCA day as the constitution and the destruction of the imperial castle <laughs> occurred on that day. Additional things such as TCA headquarters and the existence of it um, has been able to expand. Um, the server has been going on for about three months now and that is good. Uh, two months, correction. And we are heading into a farther direction than ever before. And our dream has been obtained and we want to keep obtaining that dream and all that. So let's head towards our Facebook group page uh, about where we talk about uh, all of the timeline things and stuff like that. Uh, we are here live on our TCA group page. Unfortunately, it's not like a uh, actual page, it's just a group. So you can just join a group at any time you so wish. I do want to state that um, we have some cool things uh, going on here. We have that the Trumpet Lord began his hide and seek series on July 19th, 2013 and finished it on October 3rd with 38 episodes in the hive. So that's pretty cool. This is this was our first video. Uh, let's see. The Trumpet Films Incorporated channel's first broadcast was on February 22nd, 2013, and the Trumpet Council channel's first broadcast was on April 24th, 2013. The TCA joined Z Gaming around June 8th, 2013 and left the server completely on June 26th. 2013. The TCA was on that server for only 18 days and went through three map resets, which was insane. Uh, that might be wrong. But, yeah. uh, the TCA version 1.0, headquarters 1.0, was created in Ju early July 2013, lasted for about four months, and TCA headqu the headquarters version 2.0 was created on October 25th, 2013, which lasted for about three months. The current TCA headquarters version 3.0 was created on January 30th, 2014. TCA went, headquarters went public on November 28th, 2013, and public on Hexit on February 2014. And that's about it. So that's some cool things happening on there. Um, we are been, yeah, we've been working on a lot more things. Uh, we've been working on our montage video, and just know that we are going to go down chronologically uh, from Chickencraft all the way to the current TCA headquarters, so that should be exciting. The TCA headquarters spawn has been transforming into a lot more different ways. We've gone through a lot of changes, and hopefully we can continue to keep uh, running on the Hexel server. Uh, the council will meet this week to decide whether uh, they can keep the server and things like that. The map, of course, will be saved and things like that, so it will be kind of interesting what we will be doing in the future. Uh, decisions will be made on funding, money, and things like that. Uh, hopefully we can be able to keep the server uh, if it is possible at all. New additions to the server, which is cool, is in the very back of the Trumpet Mansion. It is known as the Server Tower, which is where, uh, basically, it is said that all commands within the server are made, which is, even though it's just a myth, we like to have it there and things like that. Um, so the TCA would also like to state that we are going to do full aiding for the GamesterCraft server. More information will be given to you on that. And special thanks to the great Gamester for allowing us to uh, do all that. And 
things like that. So this is the server tower. It's really cool. Um, it's actually called the White Light Tower or something like that. It's a schematic. Of course, we didn't build it. And we tripped it out with... Um, what are these things called? Sky beams. So that's kind of cool. And the inside is awesome. Oh, I can't get in because I'm too fat. Okay, there we go. And you can turn it off from this switch right here. So that's pretty cool. And the cool thing about it is when you turn off the switch, it actually turns off the lights. You can I think you can. Yeah, you can tell. So that's cool. It turns it off, see? There it goes. And eventually this will turn off. very top is the infamous Herobrine, who is said to be the controller of the server, which is actually a myth, but anyway, he's kind of cool. And you can hit him, apparently, which is fun. Anyway, thanks everyone for watching TCA News. Trevor Lord here from the Trevor Council and Associates, and thank you for watching.